Tag team action underway. Here come the opponents. I am so excited. And now from behind. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, what, what's the meaning of this? Jumping these two from behind. Now tossing them back in the ring. The official may want to think about calling this one off. Oh, you should call this off. They can't be expected to compete now. This isn't right. It looks like they still want to continue. Wow, I, I, I can't believe they are. They're still insisting on having the match. This is nuts. Well, there's no way you can consider this a fair fight anymore. I actually agree with you both. These attackers weren't supposed to be part of the match, but that attack might end up altering the outcome. Emotions running high in this highly anticipated match, but this is officially underway. And you know, I just hope we have a clean fight here moving forward. I'm not sure you should get your hopes up. If that starts anything to go by, we are in for a drag out slugfest here. Somehow he saw Taker coming. Oh, oh man, kick to the face. Go for the arm bar and a punishing stretch. That attack was definitely pre-calculated, hoping to greatly diminish the power in that arm. A nice shot by the Undertaker. Now one of the best strikers in the business. In comes Kane. Clothesline! Off with their head. Not the position you want to be in right now. Snake eyes! Good night. Great counter! Reciprocating the initial reversal. There he goes, right into the corner. Putting up a united front as this match continues. Roddy Piper able to adapt. Gets tagged in. Oof. Ooh. He turns it around. My God, what a striking display. Practically never-ending blows. Coming at full force here. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Boom! Cover! Shoulders are down! Gets his shoulder up before the two count. He's nowhere near ready to stop fighting yet. Big forearm. Left by the turnbuckles. Shoulder tackle after shoulder tackle. Oh, man! Intercepted the attack with a kick to the face. Power slam incoming. No. From behind into an inverted DDT. Tag is made, and here we go. Here's a snapmare. Oh, Gosh, landing face first. What a barrage of stops. The proverbial mud hole has been stopped, and now it's time to walk it dry. Can he do it here? And he stops the count for his partner. Big boot. Kane gets that set right back to him. There's a snapmare. And a basement drop kick. Producing a trampling. Kane blazing a following trail of destruction. Brutal attacks here from Kane. He went right into that turnbuckle. Turned that one around. He's reversing the momentum on him. The U-turn he needed in this match could have been right there. And that's what we call the tree of woe position, folks. He gets tagged in. Oh, jarring uppercut. Kane turns it around. Oh, look at 
his aggression in the corner. Yeah, on the throat in the corner. Disgusting behavior. There was no respect shown there. The devil's favorite demon with the devil's favorite sidewalk slam. I think I speak for everyone when I say that this rivalry has gotten out of hand. Neither side of this thing is any... Kane, uh-oh. Oh, boy. The shock slam. Kane about to end this fight. Three, no, two count. Unreal. Unreal to kick out there. Not only unlikely, downright extraordinary. And Kane can't believe it. A long career of burying superstars with that very same move was not enough. Range down an elbow retaliation. DDT! Getting set up for something in the corner. Top rope, putting it all on the line. You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a position he's in. Tag, switching it up. Ooh, got caught with a punch to the face. That elbow looked like it hurt. Handle finds the mark. DDT! And you can see the effects of that on Piper's face now. He was elusive there. Close line. Play out with a power slam. He's turning the tables. Getting him into the corner. Uh-oh. Face first in the turnbuckle. He catches Kane with a counter. Oh, Ooh, what a knee lift. Somebody better. This is it. And he kicks out of the pen in one. That's smart. Taking the one to catch your breath. Matt slam with some attitude. Tag is registered. Constructing the knee there. Look at this heel hook. This is how you punish your opponent, and he's enjoyed every minute of it. Crushing the knee there. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. of ring IQ on display there. At this juncture, you have to wonder if these superstars can keep up this pace. They're certainly being taken into the deep waters now. Kane taking it to the top rope, and he gets the tag. Oh, Ooh, what a knee lift. Somebody better check his nose. He's starting to struggle here. Yeah, they stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. A club with the right forearm. And now thrown back into the ring. What a hot shot. It's all the way to the outside. Oh, Kane counters. Oh, look at the squeeze. It's on like a vice grip. Oh, that just looks nasty. Is tagged in. Bang! Vicious boot. Shoulders down. Digging deep for a kick out. Obviously, still has some fight left. Went into the corner now. Punch connects. Oh, man. Uh oh. Big punch finds its mark. Oof. Ooh. What a punch. Tagged into the action. 
action. Oh, that'll leave a mark. He's looking a little weary now. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course, they're going to wind up with a few battle scars. Oh, my goodness. The confidence of Shamrock clearly through the roof. Oh, my gosh. With one hand. And Shamrock picks the leg. Looking for the ankle lock submission. And I thought they had it won. But he makes the save. And there's the cover! And he fights it off. Somehow, some way, he is still in this. Oh. Right to the kidneys from behind. Reversal into the inverted DDT. Taker got busted up by that last attack. Running power slam! Kane gets tagged in. Draped across the top rope. Keep him down for even one at this point. The sleeper is cinched in. In trouble here. Oh, oh, what a great counter. That'll break it up. Here it is. Vintage tombstone pile driver. Nailed it. for his team. Very compromising position in a very precarious spot. The WWE faithful communicating in no uncertain terms. It is electric in here. And he sends him into the corner. Dangerous position with your feet tied up like that. Stuck in the tree of woe and being viciously kneed over and over again. Get in there, ref. A snap mayor. The crowd is fired up. Undertaker is fired up. Able to get there in time. Able to avoid any harm there. Oh, an overhand. Tag made here. Oh, no, no, no. Shamrock's oh, in serious danger. The cover coming to the rescue. Matchup and this audience is fully aware of it. Yeah, they know another turning point can come at any. Does he get him here? And a kick out at two. Incredible to think. After everything we've witnessed, we are still at a stalemate. Sent into the corner. Setting him up for something here. Uh-oh, from the top rope. Snap there from the top rope. Comes in off the tag. Ooh, body shot. Boom, right to the body. Stomping down. Getting clubbed by the axe handle. 
Shamrock keeps him at bay. Oh, tonight guys definitely a hard won victory would have been a slightly easier win without that unexpected attack well, let's just focus on the positives here We are about to witness youth and power personified. The following contest is a fatal four-way match. Making his way to the ring, representing the Creed Brothers from Lexington, Ohio. Weighing in at 285 pounds, Brutus Creed. A natural born competitor who went undefeated for an entire collegiate season. He has held NXT Tag Team titles already, and he's determined to dominate every division on every brand. And here comes one of my favorites. And his opponents, first from Melbourne, Australia, weighing in at 225 pounds. Bloody Matthews! Talk about an intense competitor. This superstar doesn't have an off switch. Nobody has an off switch, Saxton. Trust me, if you had one, I'd have hit it a long time ago.
He's been demanding this match for quite some time, and now he is ready to compete. The modern day Maharaja. And representing Indus Sheer from Punjab, India, weighing in at 238 pounds, the modern day Maharaja, Jinder. This is quite possibly the most ruthless iteration of Mahal that we've ever seen. Knows he has to set the example for the talent he has taken under his wing. The former WWE Champion is dead set on getting back to his championship ways. A promising young talent with a lot of swag. And from Boston, Massachusetts, weighing in at 210 pounds, Carmelo Hayes. I hate to pair it a catchphrase, but Melo really is money. Multiple title reigns and main events to his name already. And this guy is destined to continue that success in all of WWE. Hayes is ready for action to begin. Over the years, the WWE Universe has been treated yeah. to some legendary moments courtesy of the Fatal 4-Way. Forget that ancient history, Michael. This Fatal 4-Way has all the makings to put those past matches to shame. Oh, no question this match has all the ingredients of a good one. Well, come on, Corey. You've got to respect the legends that have come before us. Sure, I respect them. I just opt not to live in the past, that's all. Meteora! There's certainly an element of danger inherent in a no disqualification match, isn't there, Corey? More than a lot of people realize. And into the count. Broken up. And the match continues. Single leg drop kick caught him. Turns that back on Jinder. Counter after counter. Setting up for something here. the wind out with a stomp to the solar plexus. Set it up. Nice neck breaker. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? And now with the kendo stick in hand, he's ready to do some real damage. If you're going to grab a kendo stick, you better be prepared to use it. Oh, man, he has fired up now. He steers clear of contact. Caught with a lariat. It was going to be hard for 
for Creed to send a message if he gets outmatched like that. Yeah, as Hayes was giving him a bitter taste of his impressive offense.
Moves it inside. What's the plan here? Cover here! Broken up. And the match continues. That's teamwork. And he heads out of the ring. No count outs. No worries. Oh, right in there. Ooh, sledgehammer to the body. This is not for the faint of heart. Successive move is putting their opponent in the He may get the three count right here. I think so. <laughs> Carefully placed stomp to the arm. And Bruce is starting to look worn out. This match is starting to take a visible toll on Bruce. Have you ever seen a human being? This could be it, cover for the win! And he stops the count. Well, meanwhile, Creed. Oh, did you hear that? Look at these debilitating forearm strikes. Oh, right to the face. Uh-oh. He moved, but can he capitalize? Got him set up in the corner of the ring, and Creed gets warded off. To the stomach. Oh, what a kick! Right to the gut. Stunts. Oh no! Driving. Does he have him here? Got it. No, just a two. The muscle memory is going to be taken over now. Pure instinct to kick out before three. Carmelo Hayes. Gonna turn it suplex. Carmella could have this one. Cover! So much brutality with that move tonight. How in the world? Makes a cover, and the count's broken, keeping the match alive. It's not over yet. These superstars must be feeding off the WWE Universe. This place is starting to rock. Jinder Mahal. Catches the kick. Clothesline takes him down. Forget about it. Short kick with precision. Right in the face. Carmelo turns out of way. Gotta find a way to get out of this. Lands face first. What energy in this arena tonight. I'm getting goosebumps. Counters that. Kick to the gut. Back to run into a neck breaker. Ooh, dropped right on their face. Oh, look at this. So ruthless. Ducking out of trouble. Close fist connects. That's a cover. He breaks the pin. And now we see Creed. Carmelo Hayes with a suplex into a cover. Creed could not avoid the big shot. Oh, the referee caught in the crossfire. Oh, no. Could be really bad. Elbow puts an end to that. Power slam! Oh, basically hammering their opponent into the floor. Oh, strong impact! He was waiting for him to make his move.
Keeping the match alive. Uh oh. Targeting the stomach to reverse that maneuver. Oh, there's some gouging going on. That's unnecessary. Kick to the midsection. Pump handle applied. And these attacks are spelling nothing but trouble. There is nothing but malintent behind. Absolutely thrilling, fatal four-way win here tonight. An amazing performance, outlasting three different opponents. It was a real testament to his abilities. Before this match starts, maybe some good sportsmanship. Yeah, maybe that's asking maybe all too much. Oh. That's how you escalate the disrespect. Hey, maybe they shouldn't have taken the bait, right? It's all about trying to embarrass this superstar's opponent in the early going. There's the bait. And look at this now. Yes, applying the submission hold. Just get. Oh, that's one way for him to get out of it. Fight Shane back. Oh, God, that hurt. Corey Shane McMahon is, of course, known for his daredevil-esque feats in his matches. He always has to up the ante. Surely that will work for him here tonight as well. I'm torn, Cole. On one hand, this madman needs to stop putting his body on the line. On the other hand, it's worked well for him so far, so why not continue? Usually I'd say that Shane needs to exercise caution, but we all know that's not going to happen. Placing them into the corner, and they just busted out an impactful maneuver. Uh-oh. Elbow drop. Oh, impressive counter. Shane feeling a sense of confidence here. Big back drop. Oh, arm bar. Oh, that can prohibit any use of their shoulder going forward. Really just laying it in. Apollo's composure being shaken with that attack. He had to be prepared to take some damage tonight. <laughs> Brings down a hammer to turn the tide. Crash lift. He goes for the quick pin attempt. Gets his shoulder up right before two. This match is not going to end so soon. Oh, chin-breaking uppercut. Beautiful standing shooting star. Acrobatics like that take a tremendous amount of cardio and strength. Supernatural oh. power. I do not see this match going on much longer with too many more moves like that from them. You have got to be in elite physical condition to pull off something like that. Suplex. Standing shooting star press. Shane McMahon in a distressing spot. 
Shane. Here we go. Barrel I love this. roll tope. That is the attitude of a daredevil. The ability to take risk with minimal trepidation. No fear, absolute reckless abandon. Something of a competitive edge has been brewing between these superstars lately. A drive to prove who really has the upper hand here. Their competition can really bring out the best in people, and I think we will be seeing that from them here and beyond. Great trouble here. Can he get it fully locked in? And he's just in reach of the ropes and gets it to force the break. The ropes become a competitor's best friend in desperate moments like that one. That extra rotation creates so much more force than a standard splash. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Gets him with the counter. what you call impact. Moved at the right time. <laughs> Telegraph that one and delivers a blow to the gut. Jawbreaker! Call the dentist. Oh, what a kick! with the backdrop. Oh, he may be in a bad way here. Yeah, but you can't count anyone out yet. This match could still go either way. Oh, oh man. Uh-oh. Face full of turnbuckle. Shane McMahon taking command of this one. And that's Shane O'Mac being Shane O'Mac. Not exercising even the slightest amount of caution, but hey, it's working in his favor. Headed to the top now. Up high. What are we going to see? Shane O'Mac. Oh, my God. Shane went for broke there, and it absolutely... Some could say this loss really added insult to injury. It was enough to be disrespected earlier on, but the loss definitely didn't help matters. I think this win might just embolden them moving forward. The way they see it. Listen, these two have a long history of not liking each other. Look at this stare down between these competitors who are at the top of their game. The official showing a little bravery by stepping between these two. Now it's time to go. I can only wonder what those two are saying to each other. Well, I assure you it's not for the faint of heart. These two can't stand each other, and we're about to see what they're willing to do to each other. There's the battle. We've already seen the respect these superstars share for each other. That kind of respect is something that can take a superstar to the next level in their career. Oh, come on, Saxton. In WWE, you've got to hit first, or you'll be the one getting hit. Reversal after reversal, proving they did their homework. We got a cover. Raises the shoulder. Not enough to get past the one count yet. Ooh. 
And countouts are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. Uh oh. German suplex. Oh, the rear super kick. From behind, nasty. My goodness, absolute dominance. Gets tossed into the ring. <clears throat> Spiked. Butch loves to just attack his opponents at full speed, but the key to victory can't be that simple, can it? Butch used to be extremely deliberate in his strategy, Cole, but now he throws himself full force at his opponent. But that old methodical style is still dormant within Butch, so he should use it. And Butch is failing to offer any resistance here. Butch needs to cause some separation. Chin. Boom. There's not much room out there. Are you kidding me? Off the apron to the floor. Many a match has turned on that kind of contact with the apron. This could be a key moment in this contest. Big forearm. Got a hold of the arm, just wrenching. Oh, man. And arm breaker takes him down. <laughs> Boom, Butch with a timely counter. You can tell there's pride on the line here. A desire to prove once and for all who is the best. Rivalries like this can be excellent motivators, pushing superstars to new heights or forcing them to take drastic measures to ensure victory. with one message in mind, absolute destruction. And frustration might be starting to set in. Now Butch has one thing in mind. And that stops what Butch had intended. Oh, counters right into the bread basket. Quick exchange, reversing the reversal. Stuck in the tree of woe. No escape in sight. Yeah. Ah, he's got that boot right up against oh, his face. Come on. He, this one's all but over. Clean it out. And he kicks out at two. Somehow, some way. He skirts away, living to fight another day. just kicked out, and I'll tell you what, I don't really think he knows either. What's the tally on how many times we thought this match was coming to an end? I can't count anymore. They are deep into this match, and you have to think that their stamina is running out. Yeah, at this point in the match, it starts to feel like you're fighting in mud. Great win with all on the counter. Turnbuckles we go. Looks like he has his finger on the trigger now. Look out. Diving hammer strike. Hooked him up. High angle belly of back suplex. Butch now going to the top. Launching. He paid for that one. Oh man, big time. And he hightails it to ringside. He certainly has to be piecing together a new game plan now. Placed in the corner. B. 
big strike in the turnbuckle and a kick. Double underhook. And what a maneuver we just saw there. Here he goes for the win. Can he close it out? The elation of victory. And a hard fought one at that. Now, what an emotional match. You cannot say enough about the performance of this man here tonight. To battle one of his toughest opponents and come out with a victory. You can see the heartbreak and the disappointment on the face of the loser, but wait a second. Well, clenched fist, at least momentarily it appears he changed his mind it's a good thing too Caden Carter and Katana Chance, the Warriors of NXT. The following is a tag team match set for one fall. On the way to the ring, the team of Katana Chance and Caden Carter. They love to have fun, but they are all business inside the ring. You know, Carter and Chance were a team long before NXT even had a women's tag team division. And it's paid off because this team is the team to beat in all of WWE. Alexa Bliss is here. One of the most accomplished competitors in the women's division. And their opponents, first from Columbus, Ohio, Alexa Bliss. It seems like Alexa is back from the dark side, but she brought back a friend, Lily. Uh, I wish she hadn't. Oh, don't be jealous, Saxton. We know your favorite doll recently popped. We are about to see five feet of fury unleashed. And that is bad news for Alexa's opposition. Here comes Gigi Dolan. A truly confident and passionate competitor. And from Atlanta, Georgia, Gigi Dolan. A woman who began her wrestling career at the age of 17 years old. And she's one of the youngest female competitors in WWE, but already has a veteran's mindset.
Gigi Dolan has the ability to be pretty imaginative in the ring. She says her creativity is how she expresses herself. Katana Chance and Caden Carter, two superstars who refuse to let their diminutive stature define them. In fact, they even consider their size an asset. Yeah, for as small as they are, they more than make up for that with their athleticism and unorthodox offensive style. Chance and Carter's in-ring dynamic really is unmatched. They can do things in the ring we've never even seen before. And there's a lot of heat between these teams. I expect some personal shots to be taken in this one. I think the personal shots began before the match even started. And now it's a matter of what team can keep a cooler head towards victory. Looking wobbly in the corner. Gotta hurt. Trying to fight with a hurt arm is no easy task. Ooh, what a forearm club. And it's reverse pain for that mistake. Counter from Carter. Wow, running leg drop bulldog. Great ups. Uh-oh. Oh, and she turns it around. Here's a snap bear. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Kick right to the face. Oof. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Tag made. Victory roll pinning combination. Super kick to the face. Up high and bionic elbow driven down. Uh, drop toe hold, base first. And Alexa's attack gets intercepted. Shoulders down. She overcomes the pinfall attempt. Just using the adrenaline to stay in the match. We're no closer to a winner just yet. to the floor. Oh, right to the throat. Victory roll pinning combination. Super kick to the face. Working on their arm. Applied. Well, that came to an end with a abrupt punch. Oh, straight forearm. She's tagged in. to the stomach, puts an end to that. Planet face, maybe not, maybe not! Gets the shoulder up instantly. Not even close. Uh-oh, what an elbow drop. She's pushed into the corner. Uh-oh, good timing with that reversal. Go behind, into the tournament. And she goes for the pin. She was close to the end there. No celebrations yet. Alexa Bliss in off the tag. Oh, well scouted by Carter. Oh, get ready. She knows exactly what she's doing with this submission hold. Almost a miraculous escape and a side slam. Uh-oh. She's fighting back. Sequence of reversals there. Put her in a position now. Face first. She scurries out of there. Alexa gets reversed. Hoist their opponent up for a fireman's carry. Sent down into a leg drop. Very unique. Alexa's chances are dwindling. Russian leg sweep. Cover! Kicks out after one. She is 
is still in this fight. And a tag there. for wear in the corner now. Pump kick on target. She got the shoulders down. Kick out. She still has life. Somehow she's still in this matchup. It's unbelievable. Uh-oh. Oh, and a reversal. Lock up to the top rope. Top rope for a Great counter by Alexa. Dolan letting those in attendance know exactly what she thinks of them. Drop kicked all the way to the floor. Uh. Oh man, looks like her opponent's not gonna need a chiropractor. Wheelbarrow Hurricane Rana, very nice takedown. <laughs> Using the elbow to escape the attack. Hammerlock. Hammerlock. Reverse DDT. And she heads to the floor to think of her next move. Uh, time for... No way! What a cross body! That's playing fast and loose with your own body. That is weaponizing your body. That's what that was. The hammer line. Slap line. Ooh, look at her answering back. Oh, that'll prove for the victory here. Getting that shoulder up now is huge. Picks the leg. Grapevine through. Could this be the rolling deathlock? Rolling deathlock! And for some reason, she lets go of the hold. Could have just been a tease of the potential agony that's yet to come. One. And she's stunned in the corner. And Caden was scouted there. Gotta hurt. Uh-oh. Answering back. Whoa, just floating through the air. There's a tag. Tag made. Tag made. All right, in Hurricane Rana. Oh, she got out of there. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Uh oh. Look out. Oh. Simple but effective. Yeah. Side Russian leg sweep. Devastating elbow. And able to cut Katana even further down to size. From the top. Big mistake there, Corey. Well, she knows that now. Tagged in. Ooh. When you're this far into a match, you are surviving on instinct. Blow after blow. This is all about survival at this point. out the window and it paid off. Adrenaline is through the roof now. Ooh. Throws her back in from ringside. Ooh. 
tighten up the chest and now straight to the knee. Controlling the arm, the hammerlock, flatline. Cover! And they're still in this. She's got an answer for that. Ooh, what? Wasn't expecting that. The noise surging through this arena is ridiculous. It's the echoes of the universe witnessing a war. She makes the tag. She is unleashed. Got drop to her face first. Nasty kick. And set right into the corner. Reversal on chance. Worse with the kick into the sunset. Sunset bomb. Right across the knee. Heel oh. hook locked in. This is painful. Oh, man. Oh. oh, man. Targeting the leg. Bam! What a slap. Uh-uh. Ooh, slows that down with a well-placed kick. to reverse that one. Oh, straight forearm. She's looking for the win. She kicks out with force. How have we not claimed a winner yet? You gotta believe that not wanting to feel the agony of defeat is causing this never surrender attitude. Oh, across the top rope. All five feet of fury on the attack here. Bliss is executing her game plan. Taking a moment to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. Ooh, she hit the corner hard. Gigi catches her by surprise. 360 double knee face breaker. Chance concealing here. on their feet in this building. Absolutely showing the respect for all the exertion these athletes are putting. No way! Oh, God! That's finding any which way to topple the competition. Hurling your own body like that is insane. Stomp to the guts! Oh, an insult to injury. Made her pay for her mistake. This match is coming down to the last second. Someone's got to get back to the ring now. And Caden was scouted there. Well, the last second beat the count out. And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. Bad suplex. Very nice. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Gigi Dolan. What is she looking for? Here tied up for the Gigi driver. That can do Carter in. Ooh. Whoa. Kick to the gut creates separation. Will Barrow Horkan Rana. Nice. Set up in the corner of the ring. Look at this, going right after the left arm. Gotta hurt. Uh-oh. Face first. Oh my God, face first into the middle turnbuckle. And the cover for the win. This is it. Breaks the close count. Where is she finding the strength? This is unreal. Oh, targeting the arm. This has got to hurt. Torturous focus on the leg. Punishing the leg. 
Cinches up the arm and a vicious kick to the jaw. A heel hook locked in. You can almost hear the opponents yelling in agony. Places her right in the corner. Trying to work the leg here. Uh-oh. Half and half soup. Shoulders down. Could she fall and put this away? And she fights it off. She just will not go away. Not where you want to be right now. Gosh, what a match. Chance finally finding an answer to that onslaught. The U-turn Katana needed in this match could have been that right there. Oh! Right in the breadbasket. Grabs their opponent by the ankles. Might be it. Tag made. She's in. Counter with the knee to the face. Able to get the advantage here. Large forearm draped across the middle rope. And down. Ooh. That was just malicious. Insulting. Just stretching out the arm. Oh, that's just insulting. Look at that. Snap suplex. GG Dolan. What is she looking for? Here, tied up for the GG driver. Dolan landed that perfectly. Counter from Carter. Carter able to stop the blitz. That was coming her way. Time now for Caden to get her energy up and claw back into the fight. Who is treading all over their opponent? Alexa Bless, top turnbuckle. Their opponent's uh, legs. Uh, oh. That's a free fall. Gets the tag. From behind. Right after the neck. Katana chance. With authority. Oh, right gonna kick shoulders down. Three, no. You got a question. How much is it worth? How much is it worth to continue through the agony? It's obviously worth everything. Obviously worth every drop of sweat on the ground. And a carefully measured knee drop. Katana can't mount any offense. Tough spot for Katana to be in. <laughs> Chop block. She's going for it. This could be. Finally over. Here are your winners. The team of Alexa Bliss and Gigi. It's Alexa Bliss leading the team to victory. Put that match in a museum or a textbook so future teams can study to learn this craft.
The new world order is here. And the entire locker room better watch the out. contest is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 540 pounds, Kevin Nash and Six, the NWO. All these men certified Hall of Famers. Some of them are multi-time Hall of Famers. Well, Corey, that just speaks to how powerful this group really is. You're right, Byron. These men changed forever how you play the game. Backstage and in the ring. You walk around the backstage area, there are countless superstars who would love to don the black and white of the NWO. It's better than the alternative of getting beat down by them. Good point. When did they start allowing rattlesnakes in the Hall of Fame, Cole? I'm looking at the toughest SOB in WWE history. And our opponents, first from Victoria, Texas, weighing in at 252 pounds, Stone Cold Steve Austin. This is a man who instilled defiance in an entire generation. Not many fans in the boardroom or the locker room, but beloved by the WWE Universe. Absolutely no one comes close to the fury of Stone Cold Steve Austin. A true rock star entrance. There is an electric feeling in this arena. Undeniable energy to his arrival. Setting the stage for what's to come next. And from Kyoto, Japan, weighing in at 220 pounds, Shinsuke. A Royal Rumble winner, a man who's held multiple championships. A top elite level competitor all over the globe. And after all these years, a veteran who hasn't lost any of his edge. 
Shinsuke is battle tested and looks ready for more. Shinsuke Nakamura has become more villainous and more nefarious. Well, Shinsuke has finally become the main event star we knew he would be. The New World Order might just be one of the most dominant factions this industry has ever seen. For a time, they had total control over all of WCW. The NWO still tries to rule with an iron fist to this day. They know they have power and talent, so they think they should be calling the shots no matter where they are. Stand between the NWO and their plans, and you're in for one heck of a bad time. Not only will they beat you, but they'll make a fool of you, too. Enough already. Didn't see that coming. Ah, trampling the opposition. Placed into the corner. Reversal after reversal. These two are ready for each other. The lined up. And the pitch. Super cut. Hits him with the counter. Big time clothesline. Good grief. Nakamura in off the tag. How's that for a counter? Boom! Hit drop. I've been waiting to see that. Oh, Ooh, what a knee left. Somebody better check his nose. Slam the door yet. Dismantling the arm in the corner. Gotta hurt. Having a weakened arm can limit you in so many ways, making it harder to execute on even simple attacks. Face full of turnbuckle. Ooh, smash mouth offense from Kevin Nash. Big Sexy bringing a systematic and powerful attack to this match. Now he's been put on the defensive. Kamara gets the counter. Just hot shot it to the outside. Two handed. And he goes for the pin. No, he kicks out. A little closer to getting the pinfall there, but this is still anybody's fight. Now he's got him here. He's got him up. And oh! Nash looking to close this one out. Got bottled up there. Vicious knee to the body. Into the axe kick. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Into the pay window. Still only got one. I can't believe it. He just won't go away. He got whipped into that corner. Uh-oh. Face first. Oh, we know what's coming next. Shinsuke, boom! And he's able to reverse. Boom, running FTO plants him. Nicely done. Tagged in. He skirts around it. A quick exchange of counters there. Getting carried around, bad spot to be in. Driven down face first. Stopped him in their tracks with a kick to the gut. 
Kick to the gut. Cracked around into a neck breaker. He's on his heels a bit now. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course they're gonna wind up with a few battle scars. Somehow still has the energy for a quick kick out. Counter! And now there's an opening. And six is laid out. worse for wear after that offense. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course they're going to wind up with a few battle scars. Now her DDT. He could pin his opponent right here. It's over. Fights the shoulder up in one. I don't know what more this superstar can do to put him away. Bad Uh-oh. Denied via a wicked punch to the stomach. Tossed into the corner. Handle. Uh oh. Fends off the attack with an elbow. Spinebuster. Ah, uh, heel hook. Look at this. Oh, that's so painful. It's hard to watch too. Kevin Nash reversing it. Got the tag. Got the tag. Ooh. And Nash got bottled up there. Both competitors showing how well they know one another. Saw it coming and got out of there. And these guys are trying to prove they belong in the main event. That they are on top of the mountain here. Big time confidence leading to big time Matt. Here's the cover. Out. Getting dangerously close to ending it all there. Tag Steve Austin in off the tag. Oh, oh man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. This match may be nearing its limit. At this point, it might be too much for him to recover from, Cole. The pin, he's going for the pin. This could be it. Oh. position to be in right now. Oh, God, face first. Working the midsection there. Getting him into the corner. Oh, man. Shot right to the midsection. And Nash is failing to offer any resistance here. Nash is being kept in check. In off the tag. Planted with a face buster. Is it enough? The cover! Two! Yeah, no. He doesn't get the three. What? What? Oh, what do you say? That this is amazing. What a match.
Kevin Nash about to establish his dominance. Powerbomb. That's it. Oh, Nash God. just ended things. And a victory. A win. Here are your winners. Kevin Nash and Six. The end. And it's Kevin Nash finishing this one off for the team. Two men with one common goal can be a dangerous thing. They're putting the entire locker room on notice. All that gold on display. She's got to be feeling mighty confident right about now. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from the Queen City, the NXT Women's Champion and the NXT Women's Champion, Charlotte. We already knew she was an impressive talent, but holding two titles simultaneously really cements it. Yeah, that's one heck of a resume. Target on her back, and on both titles, it's time for the champ champ to go to work. women's MMA pioneer. In fact, Shayna Baszler finished most of her matches by submission. And those skills have translated to WWE women's division dominance. No stranger to championship gold, Baszler has to be eyeing this as an opportunity to raise her stock in WWE. I fully believe that titles and wins are just bonuses for Shayna. What she really likes is the fight itself. And when it comes to Charlotte, no one is more deserving of the hype that follows them. Plenty of superstars talk about being the very best, but Charlotte has always done that and backed it up in the ring. Without a shadow of a doubt, Flair's accomplishments speak for themselves, and Charlotte looks to remind everyone about them. 
And then you have Shayna Baszler, who just loves to remind everyone that she's an actual fighter who really doesn't care about being a sports entertainer or a superstar. Saxton, show even an ounce of respect, okay? Shayna Baszler's a pioneer in women's MMA. And because of that, she brings a fighter's mentality to the squared circle that pretty much all of her peers lack. Charlotte loves to slow a match down to a pace that suits her and her game plan. Would you agree, Corey, that the key to taking Charlotte down would be to refuse to work her pace? Absolutely, Cole. You keep a faster pace, you keep up your chance at disorienting Charlotte, or better yet, having her make a grave mistake while attempting to keep up. Oh, what a chop! And now tying up the leg. Straight to the knee. That kind of focused attack on the leg could provide dividends. Ankle lock. And she gets to the ropes. That's why always knowing where you are inside the ring is so important. Power story after two. Able to squeeze that shoulder out so close. Into the knee drop. And Shayna experiencing a bit more fight there than she may have expected coming into this match. Yeah, as Charlotte was really showing off her unmatched skill. Oh, ouch! Drop kick hits hard, lands harder. She heads out of the ring, but she needs to pay attention to the ref's count. Technique on display against Baszler. Back and forth from these competitors. Baszler making a statement with that. Take note from the veteran fighter and stay out of the way. Oh, they clutch their opponent's wrist, and look at this. And this is just next level brutality. And any one of those shots could take you out for good. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Cinched in this one. Oh, look at that. Ooh, elbows to the side, and that'll create the break. Oh, my God. Pendulum back, and this has got to be it. Almost ended it there. What a match. Baszler turns it around. Saw that one coming, took advantage. Oh my, devastating impact to the back. Drape upside down in a tree of woe. Stuck in the tree of woe and just having their face stopped. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. Uh-oh. Turns it around. Soul of the foot meets the stomach. She feels that enough damage has been done. Should have kept on wrenching. Why show mercy now? Yikes, that'll need to wake you up or not. She's got it. Got her shoulders down. No, she kicks out. She just won't stay down. Oh, stomping away. Stomp to the leg. The crane now going up. 
She starts to rise back up, but does she know where she is? To the sky. Corkscrew set time. She was clearly waiting for that. Overhand connects. Oh, it's punishing the right arm. Up top they go into the Rowdy Buster. Great officiating as the rep noticed she was on the ropes. A helpless Charlotte. Does it mean the end is near? Caught the leg. Oh, elbow to the knee. That'll hyperextend your leg. Each competitor wants to prove that they are the toughest woman walking God's green earth. I cannot believe the punishment these superstars are inflicting on one another. Able to avoid there. This place is going insane. The ground beneath my feet is shaking. The 110th Street Slam. Baser with the legs crossed. Oh my God! Figure four leg snap. Nasty. Surprising, no. Charlotte going for the figure four. Once she locks it in, if she can bridge out to the figure eight, this one's over. Locked in tight. Sure. And she lets her out of the submission. I don't know if it's mercy or if it's someone who's not done playing with their prey. Oh, Charlotte Flair steps through. Here we go. Perhaps thinking something else here. Not sure why, though, Michael. She seemed to have it really cinched in. And here we go. The Austin Crab, no more. Taking this outside. This could be good. Countered into the hook, Carolina. Beautiful. Oh. the need of a charm. And Baszler continues to grind it out. Matchup. Here's where Charlotte's ability to endure could get called into question. Oh! Oh! What a Charlotte way laser. Pick the leg. Oh, man. That'll tear your hamstrings. Well scouted by Baszler. She's in the ring now. Coming and got an elbow for their trouble. Counters! Disrupts the attack with an elbow to the gut. The Queen of Spades showing her power. Yokosuka cutter. Looking for the victory! Two! Breaks the count. Incredible resiliency. And she dodged that one nicely. She manages to get control. Careful to clutch. This one's going to be over soon. She's going to break down the legs. This is over. Charlotte Flair. Tap, tap, tap coming. Tap coming. Maybe not. Well, that was a very unique way to get out of that hole. This is no time to hesitate. You can feel the end coming. 
and she finds an answer to Charlotte. Flair retaliating. Hooked up. Now oh, look at the power side slam. That's another focused attack to her torso area. Opponent by the ankles. Flair oh, stepping through, has it locked in. Figure four. Perhaps looking for the bridge. There it is. And she lets her free. But the damage was certainly done, Michael. Oh, my goodness. Oh, shoulders down. This could be the one that does it for her. here quite impressively. Just remember, a defeated Queen of Spades is an angry, dangerous Queen of Spades. Here comes the double champion. The following champion versus champion contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion and the NXT Champion, Seth. When you're a champion, you have challengers and threats coming at you from all angles. When you're a double champion, well, I'd consider sleeping with one eye open, just in case. I'm sure he's already doing that, Corey, keeping his head on a swivel. Standing tall with both of his titles, he's not planning to let go of either one of them anytime soon. Just admit it, every one of us has a price. And his opponent from Palm Beach, Florida, weighing in at 260 pounds, the NXT. UK champion, the Million Dollar Man, Ted DiBiase. You know, Byron, I think it might save Mr. DiBiase a few bucks if we got you eliminated from the announce team. Uh, there is no need for that. I'm fine out here. Everybody's got a price. Byron just happens to be in the bargain bin. Got to get himself locked in to go against the visionary. 
Yeah, I'm sure he's done his homework, and I'm sure he's well aware that Seth Rollins can easily manipulate you into making a mistake. mean-spirited million-dollar man Ted DiBiase won't matter how much he flaunts his wealth DiBiase can't buy himself out of this fight look the million-dollar man simply knows what he's worth and acts accordingly putting his money where his mouth is so to speak justify DiBiase's behavior however you want Corey but there's no denying the million-dollar man would pay any price to get handed the victory instead of earning it and we'll see if he's ready for the visionary Seth freaking Rollins uh, whatever Seth wants to be called these days, Corey, one thing does not change. Rollins has always been a dangerous opponent. At Seth's core, he is still as dangerous as ever, possibly even more so. Get out of here. Oh, God, look at this ruthlessness in the bottom turnbuckle. Lives to fight another day. DiBiase trying to fire himself up. Here's a snapmare, followed by the knee drop. That'll fracture an orbital. I hate to say it, but you have to think Rollins' worst enemy in this match. Oh, oh there's a submission on the way. It's in. Figure four leg lock. Oh, look at this. He's trying to turn it. He does. Turns the pressure. Section. This match grinded him down a little. Take down. Looking for the cross face. It cinched it. Looking to free the arm and does just that. Great strength being shown here. Are you kidding me? This one is headed to the outside, not by choice. Hard to come back from that kind of impact. Rollins with a super kick after the schoolboy. My goodness. Oh, and DiBiase able to counter. Three. Expected that one. Oh! Oh, look at this. I don't want to be part of these problems. Don't want to be part of this crowd. Caught an elbow to the gut for that effort. The ref's count ain't stopping. The clock is ticking here. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. Oh, suicide dive. Vicious right forearm. Oh, he knew what was coming. Look at this. Boom. Nice. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. And DiBiase is being controlled here. Rollins keeping a level head, not expecting victory to just fall into his lap. Seth Rollins once again doing whatever it takes to defeat the competition. He is definitely determined to get what he wants. DiBiase felt that coming. And the clothesline. He can end it here. He's got him. Forces the shoulder up after two. So, so close. That could have been it. 
It's a rather crude facial reconstruction. That's not very nice. That's not right. He's in a little bit of trouble now. This is where endurance becomes so important in the late stages of the match. Oof. Jarring impact. He's able to fend off the attack. Just hot shot it to the outside. We all know Money Talks and the Million Dollar Man doing a lot of talking here. Taking it outside the ring now. Fought off with an elbow. And he gets set back into the ring. We'll be looking to end things here with the Cobra Clutch. Fading quickly. Seth Rollins close to losing this match. Whoa, this is surprising, Byron. Yeah, I'm not really sure why he would let him out right there. Oh, my gosh. Able to interrupt the attack. Dodges the attack just a smidge quicker. Held in a perilous position. Well, right to the throat. Ooh. Well, now it's roll up. Kicks out. He still has life. What do you have to do to put this guy away? Rollins. Oh, maybe time to start burning it down. Rollins is stuck. Setting up neck breaker position. Oh, bang! Into the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. Both superstars showing great awareness of their opponent's repertoire. Unfortunately for the Million Dollar Man, things did not go his way. There are some things money can't buy, including a win here for the Million Dollar Man.
The following is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Auckland, New Zealand, Tony Storm. This superstar won't ever throw him in the towel. The WWE Universe keeps egging him on. That is a recipe for disaster. Oh wait, what is so wrong with the WWE Universe supporting this superstar? It's all a prelude to a big fall, Saxton. The WWE Universe will only support you as long as you're successful. Mark my words. A determined look on her face. She knows how to prove herself in the women's division. A woman who calls herself undeniable. She's certainly lived up to that moniker thus far. And from Las Vegas, Nevada, the WWE Women's Champion, Zoe Stark! I love Zoe Stark's energy and love of competition. Well, there's no accounting for taste, but she has proven it by capturing the NXT Women's Tag Team titles. She calls herself undeniable. Well, it's time to prove it. I have every bit of confidence that she will. Starting things off with Zoe Stark, the woman who really embodies, in my view, the term fighting spirit. Zoe Stark has a hell of a pre-WWE resume. She's been tapped as one to watch by all her trainers, and she's completed a year-long rehab ahead of schedule. If there's an obstacle, say she can end it here. She kicks out with a Two. She is still fighting, still keeping this going. Oh, and then the chest as well. Suplex attempt. Able to go behind, though. Escapes, and a chop block takes him down. What's it going to take? She's still got a lot of stamina left. Zoe Stark, wait a minute, setting in. Devastating submission coming. I'm not sure she can escape by this. Yes, she does. Turns the tides. Oh, a stop right to the hand. And if the first stop doesn't send you the message, the follow-up ones definitely will. another one. Ooh. Oh, now she's looking to apply the pressure with this submission maneuver. The armbar. She does break out of it, but has the damage been done? Boom! Head kick connects. Finds a counter from Stark. Oh, what a close lock. to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. She's feeling the hurt here. German! Nine! There it is. Boom. Nice. Just pounding away. Enough already. Oh, using the knee. An impressive sequence from Zoe. Zoe's turning it up now. Looking for a high-risk move. 
Look at the height. She comes up empty. Lots of emotions in the ring right now. There's a score to be settled here. I'm not so sure things can be settled in a single match where these superstars are concerned. Yeah, things have only gone from bad to worse between them. Insulting. A shot like that to the ego could really shake you up mentally. some trouble now and this match is not over yet things are only going to get harder for spring board oh no i don't care how bold you are missing on those kind of maneuvers will send you to a medical facility a medical attention might be needed out here that was a nasty landing boom right across the small of the back watch out german suplex Nine. into the ring from the floor now. Assaulting the knee with purpose. Zoe climbs what's on her mind. Soaring. Oh, she misses the mark. Sight. Zoe with the retaliation. Oh, right to the kidneys. Ooh. Ooh, this is kicked to the spine. Starch, look at the rock this one up. Zoe setting it up. C360. That's it. Zoe oh. just ended things. Well, only two. I truly thought it was all over there. Talk about. Resilience. Yeah, but did you see how the referee had to get into position? That was all the difference. And that result leaves everyone shocked. When will the shoulder come up? Using the ropes as a launching pad. But oh, God, that, that, that's a bad landing. A totally ill-advised decision there. Maybe slight hesitation there caused the outcome. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. And it could be an uphill fight for Zoe now. Yeah, it's becoming a dangerous scene for Stark. She wants to put an end to things here. From the top, not the top. This could do it. Kick out. She still has life. She just dug down deep there, but I don't know if she'll be able to do it again. Oh, she responds with a beautiful takedown into the Achilles lock. What's going to happen here? Crawling, scratching, doing whatever it takes. She will not let this match end. Oh, using the rope to their advantage. Punishing their opponent. Judo thrown into a DDT. Cover. Two count. Ah, uh, the victory celebration now. Oh, look who's here. An unexpected guest to the party. Saying, take out the trash through the ropes. Adding insult to injury. This is how you...